Okay, so I just picked up my first solid state drive and I've been testing it out all weekend. I just kind of wanted to put it through some tests. The uh, solid state drive's boot time is on the left and the H hard disk drive, HDD if you want to call it, um, that boot is on the right. This is a test with, I hit record and power button on my computer at the same exact time and I just wanted to see which one really completed the boot fastest and the SSD beat it by about 20 seconds. The SSD completed around 40 seconds and the HDD I think finished around a minute, minute of five maybe. And um, after this test I did a test where I wrote files on the SSD, just copied them and I actually got about 400 megabytes per second transfer speed for copying files and there's a screenshot that should be coming up right around here. Another test I did was USB 3.0. I wrote a file from a external hard drive using the USB 3.0 interface and it peaked I think around 250 megabytes per second but average it would be like a hundred, mid 150. Uh, lowest I think it got to was 70 or 90. And then I also did some gaming on Metro 2033 using 1920 by 1080 resolution. The resolution was completely maxed out. I used DirectX 9, no AA, and texture filtering I believe was AF4X. But uh, I remember I did very high first. Let's see. Um, it, in terms of gaming, I actually haven't seen much of an improvement. Uh, Definitely not a noticeable one. Um, the biggest biggest plus was transfer speeds, reading, writing, stuff like that. But here's here's some gameplay. Um, uh, very high it was 20. I think it dropped to 18, 19. And here we go. Here's the swarm that I was talking about. This is the actual start. There we go. Let's see what my frames are. Frame 50 frames right now. Not too bad. There we go. Some action up close. There we go. F fifty frames on high. Uh, not not too much of an improvement if I remember right. It's not barely noticeable. I just maybe if you go with a Samsung eight thirty because Samsung drivers Samsung uses their own controllers instead of getting a Sandforce one. I, I, how much of an improvement that actually is, I don't know. I just heard about it. Samsung Gate 30s usually typically are pretty good for gaming. And there we go. That's about it I'm going to show you. And it's pretty much over. Uh, thanks for watching. This is just me testing out my SSD. See you later.